Welcome to CBI News Top Story. I'm Bill DeRosa, editor of CBI News, our monthly news and information magazine. I'm here today with John Rathgaber, CBI's president and CEO, to discuss Governor Malloy's budget proposal. John, how's the business community reacting to the governor's proposal? I think the business community is generally pleased that the governor has said that the state is open for business and that he understands the importance of fixing our fiscal problems, not just for this budget cycle, but for the long term. However, I think uh, we really do look at it as a foundation, and we're hoping that the governor and the legislature will work together to reduce the overall size of the budget so that we can then reduce the size and scope of the tax package. Uh, we know the governor is looking for some savings from state employees, but where else can spending cuts be found? Well, first of all, it's critical that the governor get the savings that he's anticipating from the state employee unions and their collective bargaining system. Uh, the, I think he's, he's outlined a number of uh, realistic savings in the areas of health care benefits and pension benefits, but more could be found through the work of the Connecticut Regional Institute for the 21st Century. They've, got a, they've done a number of things both in the area of, of pension benefit reforms and the like, things that are being done in other states which are not draconian but which will actually deliver real savings not just in the short term but in the long term. Thanks, John. To read this month's top story, go to CBIA.com and click CBI News Magazine.